Charlie's a mess in this one. <laughs> She's not the best in potions anymore because Harry's got this special book. And Ron's off snogging lavender somewhere and that's kind of rubbish. She's getting all these feelings and she doesn't really know how to deal with them. She's definitely she's struggles. Depth. Yeah, she's out of her depth in this one, which is really nice because you see a kind of much more vulnerable Hermione, I think. Thank you. Now then, how are you? I'm all right. How are not you? Not that I'm suggesting it's not an interesting look or even attractive, but what's going on with the hair? This is um, this is Hermione in her final stages of potion madness, and uh, she's meant to look a little bit like Medusa at this point. Hermione really, really, really wants to be the best to make the best potion so that she can win uh, the prize, which is this little vial of liquid luck. She just gradually gets more and more frustrated and desperate as the scene goes on. Because it's very unlike Hermione to be getting things wrong as well. Very unlike her. She we hates it. She hates not being the best. Hates it. And watching Harry do everything against what the recipe says. Says, but getting it right is just too much. It's top of the class. It's even better than you, Hermione. Slughorn thinks he's a genius. Oh. Although I spend my working life in front of the camera, this is one of the most nervous. In this scene, whilst Harry, Ron, and Hermione are visiting we It's lovely to meet him. Just don't think he's really cut out for the whole extra thing. I think Hermione sort of views Lavender as though she's kind of another another species. She doesn't quite <laughs> understand what Lavender is or how possibly Ron could be attracted to her. Excuse me, I have to go and vomit. You don't remember anything from that night? Anything uh, at all? There is something. But it can't be. I was completely boggled, wasn't I? I... boggled. Typical boys, like, <laughs> they'll say all of this when they're slightly drunk or slightly kind of not with it. And they'll say all of these things that really mean a lot to you and then the next day they'll just be like, what? What did I say? No. Yeah, I've had experience with that myself. It's not <laughs> very funny, I have to say. Not very funny. 